B B In this lesson, we are going to learn how to pronounce the vowel sound E E in English. I am Padias and welcome to English pronunciation elements. Let's begin. The word B has only two phonemes or sounds when produced. The first one is the consonant B, B, and the second one is the vowel sound E, E. So we say B, B. This vowel sound is very important in English pronunciation, and many students have trouble identifying and producing it. Now, errors in the pronunciation of this sound might have implications of meaning. For instance, many students have problems when producing and understanding these two words, of which only one has the E sound. Sheep, sheep. And sometimes these errors can be disastrous. For instance, when producing the word beach, beach, or the word sheet, sheet. The sound. This vowel sound is present in different spellings. For instance, it's the double E in the word D. It is the EA in the word T. It is the E in the word thin. It is the IE in the word ease. It is the I in the word please. And it is the E-O in the word people. Okay. B, T, thin, is, police, people. The E sound is classified as one of the long vowel sounds in English pronunciation. This vowel sound is made by lifting the tip of your tongue up to a high front position in the mouth. The jaw is closed or fairly closed and the lips are spread. This sound is produced in a front high part in the mouth. E, e. Now even though this sound is classified as a long vowel, its pronunciation could be both long and or short. Pay attention. B, B, but deep, deep. So the E sound is longer in the word B than in the word deep. This happens normally when this vowel sound is followed by the consonant sounds P, T, K, and the CH sounds. However, the key for identifying and producing this sound correctly is in the quality of the sound. This sound is what I call a double wave sound, as its pronunciation is not even, changing its intensity throughout the production of the sound. Listen. E. 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 So in here we have Deal, deal, and neat, neat. Let's see some examples. Number one, is, is. This should help to ease the pain. This should help. To ease the pain. Number two, cheese, cheese. Would you like some cheese with your bread? Would you like some cheese with your bread? Number three, deal, deal. They spent a great deal of money. 
They spent a great deal of money. Number four, feel, feel, and sleep, sleep. You feel better after a good night's sleep. You feel better after a good night's sleep. Very good. Next one, number five, heal. Heal. It took a long time to heal. It took a long time to heal. Number six. Leave. Leave. The plain leaves are half a twelve. The plain leaves are half a twelve. Number seven. Mean. Mean. What do you mean? What do you mean? Next one, number eight. People. People. Overseas. Overseas. And these. These. Many more people travel overseas these days. Many more people travel overseas these days. Okay, number nine. Read. Read. Are you able to read a map? Are you able to read a map? Number ten. See. See. The wreck is lying at the bottom of the sea. The wreck is lying at the bottom of the sea. Number 11. Tea. Tea. Would you like some tea? Would you like some tea? And the last one, number 12. Tweak. Tweak. I have extra homework this week. I have extra homework this week. Very good. Let's practice a little bit now. Try to get the sounds right to the next examples. Even, even, believe, believe, complete, complete, each, each, keep, keep, leak, leak. Magazine, magazine, or magazine, magazine. Please, please, region, region, street, street, team, team, and week. Week. Good job. Okay, there you have it. So the E sound is a double way sound. E. E. So in here we say C. C. And it. It. Well, that's all for today. Keep practicing. See you next time. Bye for now.